I'm gonna take you through the plank hold. Ideally, you wanna work up to about a minute of this, and when you get to a minute, you can make it harder with, with some variations. But first of all, what you wanna do is put a timer on, time it, see how, you get, how far you get. I usually put the phone underneath me to see how far I'm gonna get, maybe 30 seconds to start with. But what you wanna be focusing on is getting into the press or position, hands nice and, nice and wide, shoulders, uh, sorry, hands just over shoulder width apart. You wanna be locking your legs out, squeezing your bum, squeezing your core and your belly button to the ceiling and pushing the floor away as hard as you can. Okay, and this is a proper plank hold and you're almost bringing your hands towards your feet as you're doing it and you should really feel your core be nice and tight. So basically you'll get a bit of shaking, you'll get a bit of wobbling, that's good because your body um, adapting to the movement. But what we don't want to see is you don't want to see a relaxed core and just holding yourself like that. Um, we don't want to see the shoulders rolled back, we want to see the floor pushed away, we want to see the core nice and tight, we want to see the legs locked out, the bum locked out, and the shoulders pushed down, okay? That's pro a proper plank hold. 